Welcome to I'm Your Target Demographic. Today we are talking about the Marvel Cinematic Universe and we're talking about the Avengers, but we're talking post Infinity War. So we're looking past what's going to happen. Now, one of my other popular videos, which you can check out right here, is which characters will die in Infinity War. And a lot of people, including myself, believe that either Iron Man or Captain America are going to die, if not both of them. So, I want to imagine a world where neither of them are in the picture. Who then, following Infinity War, takes the reins? Who is the leader of the new Avengers? So, if we know it's not Tony Stark, we know it's not Steve Rogers, who are the possibilities? Now, my first guess is also the kind of oldest character in the MCU so far, and that is the Winter Soldier, Bucky Barnes. That in the comics, Bucky took on the role of Captain America, and they're kind of setting this up to be the same, and he was reluctant. And he didn't really know how to lead or he didn't want to lead, but people still looked to him. And so I think that could be an interesting dynamic in the Avengers movies later where there's a vacancy, there's a void, and maybe Winter Soldier is hesitant. And that could give the actor Sebastian Stan some interesting stuff to play with. That he is a killing machine and he's experienced, but he doesn't want to lead or isn't comfortable leading. The next option and the one that probably makes the most sense is Black Panther. That... You know, following Infinity War, Black Panther is the money, right? He's going to be probably the one paying for a lot of things. He's incredibly skilled. He has the nation of Wakanda at his back. Uh, in the comics, he was a heavy hitter in what we call the Illuminati. Uh, and so he is very much prepared for this role. He's a king. You know, he can obviously take over the Avengers and lead them as well. But will he? We'll see. And we really need to see his solo movie before we know much about his personality because in Civil War he was sharing the screen with so many people we need to see a little bit more of Black Panther to see if he would step up like this. Now my third choice here is the boldest because we haven't even seen this character. I think Captain Marvel has a really good chance of showing up and immediately becoming one of the most powerful members of the team and by default maybe one of the leaders of the team. That if Iron Man and you know Captain America are gone Captain Marvel might step in and say you know I'm experienced I'm a combat veteran I, you know, I'm ready to lead, and she might take the reins and do it. Um, I think not many people in the Avengers can really go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Captain Marvel, um, and I think in Infinity War, we might see just how much they need someone that powerful, which might open up a spot for her to become leader of this team. So now I want you to predict. Down in the comments, tell me if Iron Man and Captain America were gone, who would or should step up to lead the Avengers in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Give me your ideas, check out some other videos here and here that you might be interested in, and we'll see you next time on I'm Your Target Demographic.